do a plan with me in my new uh, wallet planner that I'm using. It is a um, half sheet happy planner notes or happy planner notebook that I cut down by one ring and I put it inside this traveler's notebook from Agenda 52 and as you can see um, this is what I will be using. Now this is set up um, this planner cover uh, again is a traveler's notebook cover. It has pockets here that I got some coupons in. I have some stencils. I have some stencils here. Um, I have some uh, membership cards there. I have my checkbook in here. And when you open up this planner, I created this um, card holder and then I used some of the uh, Happy Planner uh, sticky tabs to um, at to have it in my wallet at this time. I put a pocket here that I cut down to fit in this area and in here I have some postage stamps, I have some stickers, and I have some cash. So um, this planner has my year at a glance which is just some different uh, some calendars for 2019 that I cut down and paste it onto this graph paper and I started to go through and mark uh, things I need to keep track of that are upcoming um, and this is my May uh, title page and then my monthly is right here and then this is going to be the week that we are going to decorate so I'm going to pull this out of the planner And move that to the side and I uh, purchased a kit from plan for fab or plan for happy sorry I don't know why I keep I think there's another uh, shop that I've ordered from that's plan to be fab or something like that uh, this is plan for happy and this is one of her weeks Hobonichi weeks kits and I'm going to be using this one to plan for this week. Um, I'm not sure if this strip will correspond uh, with my boxes because this is made for Hobonichi Weeks and my um, layout here is a little bit smaller. Uh, it's not quite the same dimensions as the Hobonichi Weeks. And um, so I'm not sure it's gonna, if you ever buy sticker paper, do not buy the Avery sticker paper. This is the worst sticker paper I have ever used. Every time I try to peel my stickers, I peel the sticker backing almost completely off. It just, and now I just ripped that one. So we might not get to use this anyway. But let's see how this works. It might work fine and it might not. No, it's not going to be long enough. So what we're going to do is I am going to just cut these like so and we're gonna put them in each box I may need to get my reading glasses so I can see what I'm doing my contacts are drying out so it's making it hard to to see Because this is um, not the same size as the Hobonichi Weeks, it would probably be better uh, to get a kit that does not have the days of the week on there and then just use a different date stick, day sticker or even handwrite 
the days of the week in. But this isn't bad either. If, I guess if you find one that you like that does have the days of the week, you can always do like I'm doing and cut them out to fit the boxes as you need them. So there we go. We have our days of the week all lay down. Whoops. And let's see. We have some washi. This with the butterflies. And then we have this striped or this with the florals. I don't know that any of them are going to be long enough. I think I think my um, margins at the top of the page are a little bit longer than these are. But let's see. Maybe I should start it from this side. And we'll see how it goes. Just a tad not long enough. But, that's fine, I think we can make it work. Again, like I said, if you buy your sticker paper, I would not recommend the Avery sticker paper. If you have a suggestion of what sticker paper you like personally, leave it in the comments below and I would love to hear the sticker paper that you use. So let's see. So we have that across the top. Now this didn't come with any kind of date um, dots. So I don't know if this pink will be bright enough or if I should stick with black. I use my Sharpie marker. So this is going to be the 29th, the 30th, the 1st, the 2nd, the 3rd, the 4th, and the 5th. Okay. So we have that done. Now these boxes here I will probably use to track the weather uh, for the week. And I'm going to use, I'm going to put down things that I know for a fact, like this is the weekend, Saturday and Sunday, so I'm going to put that weekend sticker right there. And I know on Monday... this Hello Monday sticker here. And then I'm going to use a coffee cup to put right after that. So we have that. Um, Monday the 29th. I don't think I have any bills that are going to be due. Um, I 
This one says it's finally Friday. And we'll put that right there. Now, Friday and Tuesday are trash days. So I'm going to, she has a little trash can that I'm going to put on Tuesday. And then on Friday, I'm going to use this little circle with the trash can in it to note that. And then Wednesday, Wednesday, I have a photography club meeting. Although I haven't really been attending this club for a while, it's the beginning of the month is always a hard time for me to attend meetings and stuff in the evening because we're closing out the previous month at work and sometimes I'm having to work late. But I'm going to put it down here anyway just so I don't forget about it. And if I can attend, I will. So that's on Wednesday. And then Thursday, I don't have anything. Friday, I have the trash there. And then Saturday, Saturday is church, and I'm going to use this green box here. And I'm going to put that right there. And I'm going to use this one that says remember. church in there and then Sunday Sunday is the normal things Maybe I'll use some of this thicker washi over on the other side. This is going to be wider than what I need it for, so I'm going to just trim this off using a gift card, just like that. And then what I'm going to put there is I'll put this down right here. for my menu
Sunday is usually my day for household things. So we usually, I usually do my grocery shopping and I do some laundry. set up my planner so this will be grocery shopping laundry and then set up planners so there we have that and down a couple boxes for tracking my YouTube and my Instagram numbers and I'm gonna do that over here there and this little TV we'll put right here for YouTube camera I'll put right here for Instagram and then I'll put my uh, subscriber number and my follower number at the beginning of the week there um, I can get it off of this sticker paper and I'm going to use it to divide this area here and again use my gift card to trim the washi Trackers down. There's two in this kit. So we'll put one here and we'll put the other one here. And these are what I'll use to track when I post or upload to YouTube and Instagram for the week. And then I'm going to use this polka dot washi to 
divide this next section. And again, we we'll use the gift card to trim it. Butterfly washi. Like we did up towards the top. Just right here at the bottom. Okay. And don't really have anything on Thursday. So, I'm going to take this banner and just put it across like that, just to put some little decoration there. And I think that is going to about do it. I need, I wish there was something that says. Like meals or meal plan. Yeah, I can use this. Banner here. Oh, I thought I could peel it up, but I guess not. Um, put meals there, and then here. note that says to do. I wish it said notes on it, but well, I say I'm going to use it, but it's Maybe we can divide this. Let's see, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, fourteen, fifteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
and do a division up this way. That'll leave us with a section for to-dos. And I don't know if I should do errands or to buy. Guess we can do errands. that and again I'm going to use these boxes to track my weather um, and things like that and I guess that will probably do it for this Plan with me. Although I don't really have a whole lot. I'm trying to decide. Do I put one of these decorative boxes like on Tuesday just to take up space? Checklists. Tuesday. And on Wednesday. And on Thursday. Friday, and I won't put one on Saturday or Sunday because I have things on there already. So I think that will do it for this plan with me. Um, this is kind of new to me, so. Hopefully it will get better um, in the future, um, but I hope you liked it. I hope you um, like this little uh, planner that I've kind of created from the half sheet notebook. And we're gonna pop these back in the planner and see how it looks. there we go there's our week for the 29th of April through May the 5th set up and ready to go I hope you enjoyed this plan with me if you liked this video please pr please press the like button um, if you have any questions or any comments please leave them below and I will get back to you if uh, I have any answers that you are needing um, if you'd like to subscribe to my channel, you can press the subscribe button. 
And don't forget to hit the notification button if you want to be notified when I upload anything new. And if you'd like to follow me on Instagram, you can find me at Jelly Beans Planner Nook. So thanks again for joining me this evening. I hope you liked this plan with me. I hope you'll come back and join me again, and we'll sit down and we'll make some plans. Have a great evening.